Hi, welcome back to the channel. Today I'm joined by Brenda. Uh, if you don't know her channel, she is from Beyond Beza, and you want to tell them a little bit about your channel before we get into this reaction? <laughs> um, so I do paranormal videos on my channel, and I don't know if anyone would be interested in that from here. But yeah, that's basically what I do on mine. Yeah, it's it's really fun stuff. She's got a great audience and she's always responding to her comments down below. Go check out that channel. She has a really awesome vibe going on if you guys like spooky stuff. And I always, yeah, I always have her channel at the end of these videos so you can go ahead and check that out. But today we're going to be watching hopefully two spots from the Super Bowl. One of them is for Doctor Strange and the Multiverse of Madness. That trailer dropped today. I think that's trailer number two. Moon Knight also dropped like a 30 second ad which will also roll into this one and yeah that's it that is it so thank you guys for watching so far now let's get into the trailer actually before that do you know what dr strange in the multiverse of madness is are you kind of all caught up in the mcu and stuff yeah now let's watch it every night i dream the same dream Oh, he just came. <laughs> he sure He said the he said the title. He said the thing. I did what I had to do. This looks incredible. To protect our world. You cannot control everything, Strange. You opened the doorway between universes. And we don't know who or what will walk through it. This movie just looks Wanda. Crispier what do you know than about other the MCU universe? movies. Viz had his theories. Yeah. He believed it was dangerous. Whoa, a Minotaur. He was right. <laughs> I'm yeah. sorry, Stephen. There's a lot of movies dropping this, this Your year. Desecration of reality. Will not go unpunished. Whoa. <laughs> We got Ultron bots. We should tell him the truth. Was that Professor Xavier? Oh my God! Some America Chavez. Things just got out of hand. Oh, this is crazy. Man, who's that? Who's that? You break the rules. Look out! That's America Chavez. Wow. Oh. Become a hero. I do it. I become the enemy. Oh my god, so they are building her up to be the villain. That doesn't seem fair. Or I guess in the ultimate dimension. <laughs> oh my god, this looks so cool. This looks tight. Crazy. Dude. And it feels like a Sam Raimi film. Me. Danny Elfman is also doing the score. It's cool. Yeah. Oh my god, that looked that looked pretty cool. What do you thought? Or uh, what do you yeah, thunk? <laughs> what you thunk, huh? I thunk a lot of things. <laughs> that, I was know, awesome. that was crazy. I, I like all the um, effects that they put into this movie. There's a lot going on. Yeah, and it looks really stylish. There's a lot happening in this, and also like I thought that was Professor Xavier's voice. I'm not sure if it was. It might be. I, I'm probably totally wrong. They literally gave us like two seconds of whatever that was. Yeah, but it's like maybe they're introducing the Illuminati in this. If Xavier is in this, I don't think he is. But if he is. That'd be pretty cool, because yeah. I, I know he's, um, or I know that the MCU is trying to introduce the Illuminati in this, which is like a group of the uh, most intelligent people in the Marvel Cinematic, or Marvel Universe. Mm -hmm. So it's like Reed Richards, um, it's Black Panther, uh, Professor Xavier, I, I think Doctor Strange is in there? But yeah, just like the most intelligent people in their fields. If, if that's the case, that's so cool. And yeah. I, I love that they're going into a different dimension, they're seeing what happens. Um, like, Doctor Strange is apparently like a hero in this other, well, he's a hero in this dimension, but like he's, he like sacrifices himself or something, yeah. and also Wando, Wando? Wanda. <laughs> Wanda's the villain. I, I'm so... Psyched to see this. That's her um, alternate personality, Wando. Wando. <laughs> the male her. Spanish version. <laughs> That's evil one. Uh, well, you saw WandaVision, right? Yeah. Yeah, so 
it looks like we're going back to that a little bit and I don't know it's just I, I need to watch this again because there's so many things missing in this um, that I just completely glossed over Ooh, whoops I'm sorry I don't know if there's anything I, I didn't catch or we didn't catch let us know in the comments down below if anyone's watching this um, but yeah let's watch the Moon Knight trailer I, I'm super excited for the multiverse of madness it, it looks so good like the black levels also look really really good and because my birthday the one thing i get about to the introduce MC you movies, to my girlfriend that, who is amazing oh, birthday yeah. everyone today is like they all kind of like look muddy or kind of gray yeah but I this think one they looks... had to like tone it up for all of the um special effects they were doing for it yeah because they, they were going ham with it i feel like sam raimi took this one and he was like ah no guys we gotta make this look shiny we gotta look, make this look pretty um because i feel like that's the only way he could come into the project is if he could really just make his own movie and he already kind of loved the character already and he's always been a fan of that character so the fact that he's doing this is really it's really cool yeah. really exciting okay so the one uh, was a full full-on trailer is this just a full-on yeah, uh, okay. So I guess they dropped the full-on trailer for Moon Knight. I thought it was just like a 30-second ad. Uh, I guess not. So let's go ahead and watch that. All right? You ready? Yeah. I can't tell the difference between my Whoa. waking life and dreams. It must be very difficult. The voice is in my mind. Ooh, in your head. There's chaos in you. <laughs> That's sick. Okay. Was that an ad for the ad? <laughs> <laughs> Hello, and welcome to staying awake. I have a sleeping disorder. I can't tell the difference between my waking life and dreams. Hello, and welcome to staying awake. I can relate. Oh, he's got sand all around his bed. I'm losing it. We'll catch you on. You're bloody useless, Stevie. Steven. <laughs> I can't tell the difference between my eyes and dreams. dreams. Oh. Thank you. <laughs> the contact lens <laughs> let me find it thanks that looks like something that would come out of like the conjuring movies it's creepy <laughs> this is this feels like the original trailer yeah oh my god you're alive what's wrong with you mark why did you call me mark did you call me mark it must be very difficult in your head. I love the accent he's putting on for this. There's chaos in you. This is just the original trailer. So maybe there was just the 30 second ad, because yeah. I think I think this is just combining those two. Oh. The chaos. Yeah. Who cares? I mean, I'll still re I'll still react to it. Look at that. Beating up a dog. <laughs> Moon Knight is an animal I abuser. Like, oh my god, <laughs> the dog. <laughs> yeah, that was just the OG trailer. Okay, so there was a 30 second ad. All right. Yeah, before it. But I guess this is for you. Yeah. Are you excited? Yeah, to see looks it? fun. Yeah, you love horror, so. I know, creepy. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. I was oh. gonna say that um, when he was like, he tied himself to the bed. Reminded me of um, Prodigal Son. He does that because he has like a sleepy thing. I was like, where have I seen mm. that before? Yeah. It, he did that same thing because he wakes up in the middle of the night. Walks. That's cool though. Never watched that. Oh yeah, yeah. You did yeah. it. Yeah. It's, it's, a, it's a good show, but then second season... Not as good? Yeah. Mm. And anyway, this is cool. I like that. I was going to say the character, he has his split personality. Not split personality disorder, but he, he basically has multiple personalities and he 
has to come in and out of them and mm. whatever happens he can't kind of retain that information so that's like what part of the comic runs is the there's a mercenary named mark specter and he comes across the egyptian god khonshu who is basically the moon god and he grants him the power to become the moon knight which is like a vengeful spirit um mm. but in some of the comic iterations it's implied that maybe that's just all made up in his mind but maybe it's actually real, so that's like mm. some of the cool parts yeah. of it, and it really does feel like a really cool, rich project that they could really attack if they do it correctly. But based on this trailer, I think I think it looks really honoring, yeah. and it looks really cool. And that TV spot ad, seeing his uh, cape with yeah. the actual moon, is that's straight so out fun. of the comics. It looks it looks incredible. Yeah, it looks cool. I think I'd watch that. Yeah, yeah. Uh, yeah. That's it. That's it. That's all I got. Alright, can I go now? <laughs> Just kidding. Alright, well, thank you guys for watching. Um, I hope you guys enjoyed this. And that's it, guys. Uh, we're signing out. Uh, thank you guys for watching again. And as always, I'll see you later.